Mount Rainier, an iconic strait of volcano in Washington state, dominates the skyline with its snow-capped peaks and lush surrounding forests. However, beneath its serene exterior lies a powerful geological force capable of wreaking havoc across the region. Understanding the potential eruption of Mount Rainier is crucial for scientists. Mount Rainier, a majestic peak located less than 70 miles from Seattle, has long stood as an iconic feature of the Pacific Northwest. However, its beauty comes with significant risks, as it is one of the most closely monitored volcanoes in the United States. Scientists from the U.S. Geological Survey USGS, keep a constant watch over its activity, ensuring early detection of any signs of eruption. Standing at 14,411 feet, Mount Rainier is the highest peak in the Cascade Range and one of the most dangerous volcanoes in the United States. Although it hasn't erupted in over 500 years, Mount Rainier is considered an active volcano due to its history of eruptions, ongoing fumarolic activity, and significant geothermal heat flow. Mount Rainier poses no immediate threat, but scientists remain vigilant. Currently, Mount Rainier remains in a state of background activity, posing no immediate threat. Research geophysicist Alex Ezzi from the USGS Cascades Volcano Observatory explains that advanced monitoring systems, including infrasound and seismic sensors, track magma movement beneath the surface. According to us, gas sensors detect changes in volcanic emissions, while GPS devices measure ground deformation. These tools would likely provide months of warning before any major eruption. Despite this reassurance, Mount Rainier ranks third on the USGS list of the most dangerous volcanoes in the United States. This ranking is based on its history of large eruptions and its proximity to densely populated areas. An eruption could pose serious risks to communities in the foothills, such as Puyallup up in Ording, where residents are at greater risk of experiencing lahars, destructive volcanic mudflows. Mount Rainier's glacier hazards, how lahars pose a threat to communities. Unlike the explosive eruption of Mount Street Helens in 1980, Mount Rainier's hazards stem from its extensive glacier cover. These glaciers can melt during an eruption, generating massive lahars that flow downstream and devastate everything in their path. Past lahars from Mount Street Helens reached up to 60 miles, destroying homes and infrastructure. Recognizing this risk, communities near Mount Rainier hold regular evacuation drills, with tens of thousands of participants preparing for potential emergencies. Mount Rainier's volcanic activity is not an isolated concern in the Cascade Range. Other nearby volcanoes, such as Mount Adams and Mount Street Helens, are also under surveillance. Recently, Mount Adams experienced a series of minor earthquakes, drawing attention from scientists, Washington Post reported. While the activity is unusual, USGS experts emphasize that there are no immediate signs of an eruption. Additional seismic stations have been installed to better monitor the area. For Mount Rainier, the monitoring efforts are part of a broader strategy to protect the millions of people living in the Seattle metropolitan area.